Well, hey everyone, my name is Bill and I'm the lead pastor here at Arizona Community Church. Well, I recently read a post on Facebook asking people the question, are you afraid to share what you are really thinking for fear of being attacked? Not surprisingly, a lot of people responded saying that they were in fact afraid to share what they're really thinking for fear of being attacked. I think for most people, it's just not worth the pain and heartache given how aggressive people are in the world today. But what about those of us who are Christians? Should we let fear of persecution keep us from being bold in our proclamation of the gospel and other kingdom issues? The Bible time and again tells those of us who are children of God to fear not. Isaiah 41.10 says, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. All throughout the Old Testament and New Testament, bold believers in the Lord proclaimed the truth, no matter the cost to them. And in some cases, they were put to death. Thankfully, at least right now, the chances of someone putting me to death for proclaiming the gospel is pretty low, really next to none. Which means I should be more bold than ever, not letting fear grip my heart or win the day. So what about you? Are you letting fear keep you from being bold for the Lord? If so, get bold today and open your mouth and proclaim the gospel in a world desperately in need of it. If you are attacked in the process, consider yourself blessed, for great is your reward in heaven. Thanks for taking the time to listen. God bless.